doing? This is Rich from Rich TV Live, and I have some more breaking news from Grand West Transportation. You can see Grand West Transportation has been a huge winner, been as high as $4.59, currently at $2.45, and started at $0.23 cents around a year ago, almost to the day. So it's already been a 10-bagger, and the reality is it's my top electric vehicle stock of 2021, and I believe that this story is just getting started. BUS in Canada, BUSXF in America, once again with big breaking news. And you guys know that here at Rich TV Live, we love to bring you the breaking news first. Look at this, 17 cents, March 30th, a high of 344, currently at 196, and about getting ready to go onto the NASDAQ. That's right. So huge news coming from Grand West Transportation. This is their website, grandwest.com. And you can learn about their vicinity buses at vicinitybus.com as well. And here's the big news. Grand West appoints respected industry veteran Manuel Achadina as chief operating officer. Grand West Transportation Group, Bus in Canada, BUSXF in America, 6LG in Frankfurt, Germany, a leading supplier of electric CNG, gas, and clean diesel buses, today announced that it has appointed respected industry veteran and prominent Canadian transit leader, Manuel Acherina, as chief operating officer. Mr. Acherina will succeed Jonathan Leskowicz, who has transitioned to a focus on product development. Over, for over 25 years, Mr. Achadina has built a reputation within the transportation industry for his strong work ethic, results-oriented drive, and exceptional ability to forge and maintain strategic alliances. Mr. Achadina was previously president and CEO of BC Transit from 2008 to 2018, where he led the development and implementation of BC Transit's evolving business strategy. During his 10 years as CEO, annual revenue and ridership grew to over 261 million and 51 million passengers, respectively. He represented BC Transit with riders around the province, as well as partners, businesses, government leaders, and other key external groups. Mr. Archadina also focused on BC Transit's sustainability efforts with a commitment to lead the growth of transit-oriented communities across the province. Previously, Mr. Archadina Achirina served as the British Columbia Ferry Service, Inc., most recently as Vice President, Terminal Operations, where he was responsible for overseeing the operations of 48 terminals along the coast of British Columbia. Prior to that, he held government positions with the Ministry of Finance and Corporate Relations, as well as the Ministry of Employment and Investment. Mr. Achirina holds a Bachelor of Arts, Economics, and a Master of Public Information, both from the University of Victoria in British Columbia. On behalf of our board management team, we are privileged to welcome an industry titan such as Manuel to our company, said William Trainer, Chief Executive Officer of Grand West. Manuel brings over two decades of leadership experience in the transportation industry, where he built a truly world-class transit authority for British Columbia. His extensive experience and industry knowledge will be instrumental in accelerating our growth as we expand our market dealer network, scale production, and capacity and market our new line of innovative electric buses. In conjunction with the appointment of Manuel, due to the advancement in Grand West's new product lines, particularly with the electrification of the vicinity buses, Jonathan Lekowicz will be moving to a product development role. Jonathan has over 17 years of transportation experience and 22 years heavy duty experience with alternative fuels, emissions, compliance, and regulation. He will continue to bring his in-depth understanding of the entire product development process to Grand West to the new role and will direct our team in the life cycle of the continuously improving line of vicinity buses. The company also announced it has granted an additional 300,000 incentive stock options to Mr. Asidina at an exercise price of 240 for a period of five years. The options will vest in equal tranches every six months over a three-year period about Grand West Transportation Group. Grand West Transportation Group bus in Canada, BUSXF in America, 6LG in Frankfurt, Germany, a leading supplier of electric, CNG, gas, and clean diesel buses for both public and commercial enterprise use in the US and Canada. The company's flagship line of vicinity buses, which maintain a dominant market share in Canada, are produced by the company's world-class manufacturing partners or at the company's Buy America Act compliant assembly facility in Washington state. 
Grand West Innovative Vicinity Lightning EV bus enabled through a tier one strategic supply agreement with BMW batteries and components seeks to lead the global transition to more sustainable transit vehicles in the private and public markets. So once again, they show their websites and I can show that to you as well. This is the big news. Grand West appoints respected industry veteran, a Titan, Manuel Echendina as chief operating officer. So just building the team. Here's the vicinitybus.com website. Here is the grandwest.com website. And here's the stock. You can see BUSXF in America currently up 2% today on the news and bus in Canada. Had a big dip last week. Good to see it starting to come back up, find a floor. Let's see if it can maintain these prices. Now remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence, always do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here in Rich TV Live. Always invest in the best, the best is blessed. Consult a financial advisor and ask the financial advisor about these picks, chances are they're going to say, wow, there's some really good picks. So if you take a look at the trend here, you can see it's been trending down since it hit those highs and went all the way from four to $2, which you can see has been a buying opportunity based on the fact that people have been buying it from those lower levels. It hit a low of 208 last week, which was the lowest it's been in quite some time since we've covered it actually. And you can see now it's starting to gain some steam from there, currently at 246, up 2.5%. Love to know what you guys think about this news. If you like the video, please smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere, and subscribe. This is your boy Rich from Rich TV Live. We bring you the winners, and we bring them to you first. We brought you bus first. I told you it's my number one electric vehicle play for 2021, and I wasn't kidding. Thank you guys for watching. If you're not winning, you're not watching. Like we said, we bring you the winners, and we bring them to you first. Congratulations to members all over the world on so many winners, one after another after another. Bus right now at these prices, I believe, is extremely, extremely exciting. Love to know what you guys think. Comment on, on the video. What do you guys think about these prices? Do you own the stock? Are you thinking about this stock? Are you planning to buy it? Are you looking for a dip? Do you think it goes lower from here? Do you think it goes higher from here? Love to, love to know what you think. And remember, they will be doing a reverse split. So it's going to be interesting to see how it does after the reverse. A lot of people have sold, thinking that maybe due to the reverse, it might come down. So we'll see what happens. But after the reverse, they will have a tighter share structure, a tighter flow. This is big news. Love to know what you guys think. Your boy, Rich from Steve Live. And I'm out. Peace. Welcome to the board, Manuel Acherinha, the new chief operating officer, the new COO. Hopefully I can interview him soon. We'll see you guys soon. Have a great day.